Yo, what is up, you guys? I have an awesome video to share with you about Otter Finance. Is Otter Finance going to be the next OM, the next OHM? I don't know. I can't tell you that. I can tell you, though, that I am not a financial advisor. Don't take anything in this video as financial advice, okay? Always do your own research. This is purely for education's sake. So I found this awesome little OM fork. It's not getting the same amount of attention as some of the big, weird, esoteric ones. But I believe that this could be one of the most awesome Ohm Protocols forks out there with definitely has the like the probably the best community. And to me, that says everything. So Otter Finance. What is Otter Finance? Otter Finance is an Ohm fork on the Polygon network. Um you know, there's a lot of these right now. We're definitely in Ohm Fork season. There's also a lot of rugs. There's a lot of scams. So you have to be very careful. You have to vet all of these projects very carefully before you ape in. And if you do ape in, you know, use small amounts of money. Use it wisely, right? Because the power in these protocols and these projects is not in trading them. Like, we're not here to be a day trader with Otter Finance. That's crazy. The, the, the power here is with compounding interest. It's with rebasing on your original stake and getting returns daily. That's that's what we are doing here, right? So Otter Finance, what is it? It's a fork of ohm on the Polygon network, which I think is awesome because we're talking very small gas fees to do any kind of transaction, one to three cents usually for like a swap or a stake, okay? So to be clear, to be able to use this, you need to have the Polygon network available on your metamask so you'll need to go find a tutorial on how to set up the polygon network on your metamask and then you need you're going to need to go get um, mai or modic or something like that uh, to be able to get started here okay so let's take a look at uh, what otter finance is all about right now market cap of around seven million like very low some of these protocols just went to like 100 million like right after launch so this one is still like you're, in my opinion, you're, you're still very early. If you're looking for an awesome ohm fork, this one is still very early. Again, DYOR, right? Um, right now, the price of Clam, which is their native uh, token and the ticker, is $21.72. Um, I do, by the way, have a small stake in this, a very small amount. Um, treasury balance of around $3 million, and they have a multi-sig contract, and we're going to go a little bit deeper into that in a minute. Um, the, the total value locked in the staking pools is uh, close to six million right now, and the staking APY is 146,000 percent, right? Which is nuts. That's your return in a year. A quick caveat there these APYs go up and down. This is just what it's at currently. This always changes day to day based on the staking pool how many people are staked and how many people are unstaking. Okay, so the more people unstaking, the APY goes up because the reward pool um, has less people to distribute to. At least that's my understanding of it, okay? Um, right now, the backing per clam is $5.76 in the treasury, I believe, right? So even if, so basically, as long as that stays true, the token can't go to zero because it's always backed by at least $5.76 per clam, which becomes very important when you think about these things for the long-term investment stake. The runway at this current APY is 97 days based on the rewards. And uh, the current index, which is tracking the amount of S-Clam accumulated since the beginning of staking, uh, basically how much S-Clam one would have if they staked and held a single clam from day one is about 1.2. Okay, let's jump over to the stake page. Let's talk a little bit about what is going on there. All right, so you can see I have a small amount of staked S clam. S clam is what you get back when you stake a clam. Okay, so it's basically wrapped in their protocol as S clam. I have 11.38 right now. My next reward amount is 0 .0787. So basically 0 .08. This rebases to me three times a day every eight hours. And my next reward yield is basically 0.66. 8%. Okay, so my ROI here every five days is 10% right now currently. So basically every five days I'm getting 
um, a little bit over one more clam automatically added to my stake pool. And because of compound interest that just goes over time, it just it just grows and it grows and you just get that parabolic mm, that upswing that everybody loves to see in any crypto market. But you'll get to see it just automatically. Right. So right here, what is this? My stake balance and warm up. Man, I tried to do this video a minute ago and the whole thing bombed. And I did like a how to on how to get the modic and swap it and everything. So I ended up with a small amount of clam because of that video and I was going to go and stake it. So a new thing that they've implemented is what is called the warm up phase. And I believe this lasts for two epochs or 16 hours. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. Okay. Um, but essentially after that warm up phase, I'll come back in here and I'll be able to claim this and stake this. Meanwhile, it is still rebasing. You just can't see it. Of course, at least that's my understanding. Okay. So <clears throat> Let's jump real quick into the Discord, and I'm going to show you guys. Well, let me first actually show y'all sort of the magic here, right? Like why you want to pay attention, why why you want to be staking these projects and not day trading them. Okay, so this is how compounding interest is it works on Clam essentially, right? So in 34 days, I'll have two times my stake. So I'll have if if we're going on today's date in basically a month and four days, I'll have roughly 22 Clam staked. In five days, or in, to get to 5x that, I need to get to 80 days. So I'll have roughly 50 to 55 clam staked, okay? Now the magic happens down here. The longer you stake, the higher that goes. To get to 10x that, 115 days. To get to 100x my original stake, 229 days. And to 1,000x my original stake, basically a year. All right, now let's jump over here to this little calculator. Um, I believe there's another one floating around in the Discord. So this one just has a caveat. This this might not be 100% correct. So <clears throat> if I have after my claim, if I have 11.7 staked, and let's say it's at today's price, it just stays constant around the $21. Um, and at the, the current, the rebase, this is actually a little low right now. Um, basically, basically, this is how this works. And th this is actually wrong too because... The current APY is higher than this, but let's just keep this as a baseline for the purpose of this video. My daily ROI is 1.85%. My weekly is 13% and my monthly is 73%. My yearly is 80,000% if we're going on that APY. Currently, it's actually like more like 146,000. What does that mean in terms of um, actual CLAM and USD? Over a year, I'm looking at $196,000 USD or close to 9,300 CLAM. Let's just assume that clam, let's just for the sake of like the worst case scenario, and I don't believe this necessarily will happen, clam drops down to that $5.6 backed amount, okay? I'm still looking at just from that tiny amount staked, $52,000 USD. Now let's like look at a more optimistic approach after a year. This just number just grows crazy, $561,000, right? So um uh, again the power here is compounding interest it is not in day trading for um for you know small gains here and there okay so let's jump into the chat like this is why i'm so freaking bullish on this this project is really is in here is the community this is where that meme of three three is really happening right now this is definitely the best community in on the internet for Ohm forks. Everybody's po is positive. Everybody's bullish. Everybody gets it. The devs are active. They're building. Uh, they're doing all kinds of partnerships planned. So take a look at this. This just happened today. Uh, Otter King dropped in the chat. Great news. They've announced a collaborative partnership with Chi Dao. Chi Dao. Moving forward, you'll be able to. They're working closely with Chi Dao to develop clan pools and pairs for collateralized loaning. So what does that mean? What is Chi Dao and why is this so freaking bullish? So Chi Dao lets you take your staked clam or will in the future once they've got this set up. They'll let you stake it and then borrow other assets to interact cross-chain on Polygon, Phantom, Avalanche, Solana, etc. And you can go take that loan essentially and go use it to your advantage to go earn. You can you can restake it with Clam. You can buy more Clam. You can go buy Time, Wonderland, Ohm, whatever you want to do with it, right? There's obviously risk involved in something like that. But the point is, 
why this is so bullish, right, is these people are act like the otter community here is actively working to build a ecosystem to connect to other protocols, other communities, and to bring on more ways to um, add value to the otter family in here. And that's exactly what Wonderland and Ohm did, right? Wonderland and Ohm are so successful because they're building out massive ecosystems that extend the value of their protocol into other communities. And Otter Claim is doing that. And with a very small Discord number of 5.2 thousand, this is one of the smaller like Ohm fork communities, but it's so badass. If you just jump into the chat here, you can see actually just how bullish everyone is, right? Like I've never seen such an excited, happy community. All the other forks are just like, it's just like crazy esoteric nonsense in there. Like everybody is just freaking, freaking out. There's rugs everywhere. There's all kinds of stuff happening. And here everybody is super passionate about Otter because it's an awesome meme. And I believe that this truly is one of the best. If you want to get your feet wet with the Ohm fork, um, season that we're in right now and you can check out my other video on that i think this might be one of the best places to start again not financial advice this is purely for education only and i'm here for the memes i'm here for the community like this is a fun community and that is the that is like the basis of how everybody wins with these ohm forks if you're staking the and the protocol is active Everybody is winning. If you're unstaking and day trading and selling it, everybody is losing. This is truly about uh, the community. That's what DAOs are about. Um, they're very helpful. Everything you need, by the way, is in this Discord. So do not click on links outside of here. I would go into their Discord, and I will drop an invite to their Discord on, below this video. But you can, you can come in here. You can see... Um, a link to their pricing charts down here. You can see their docs. You can see their GitHub, uh, their main website and everything. And, and this is, by the way, down here, the quick swaps pair is where you're going to need to swap MAI for Clam to stake it. So you should go find maybe a, um, a tutorial on how to on how to stake this um, or drop again, drop in the chat here and start asking some questions. I tried to make a tutorial. The video went down. Um, so I'm not even going to bother with that right now. But again, come into this chat, check it out, ask a lot of questions. I hope that I've shed a little bit of light on this. I'm not the most technical when it comes to these DAOs and those protocols. I'm much more like I'm just more interested in the means than the community. So I may not have explained everything appropriately here. Now, what I'd like you to do, please, is come over to the subscribe button, smash that subscribe, show YouTube that you like this content. Show me a little bit of love on the channel so YouTube will start sending me a little bit of ad crumb revenue here and there. And stay safe out there. Do your own research. There are rugs all over the place. Like just yesterday, I saw two or three more rugs um, on these different protocols. And I'm in a bunch of these projects right now. And, you know, some of the shenanigans that are happening is frankly um, quite nerve wracking. So, again, like for me, investing in this stuff is long term. I'm not uh, I'm not trading with money that um you know would feel like a risk to me just small amounts here and there um that's the way to 33 and have fun so jump into the otter clam community join the chat and say hello talk to you guys soon